All right, let's focus in a little bit more on Georgia. It is a tight race between Republican Herschel Walker and Democratic Senator Raphael Warnock. In Walker's hometown, people are split about the former football star's candidacy. CNN's Diane Gallagher went to Wrightsville, Georgia, to see what people there are saying. Even before the sun rises, the hottest topic in town comes up in conversation at the Cornbread Cafe. I like Herschel because he's all business. For more than 40 years, the tiny town of Wrightsville, Georgia, has been talking about Herschel Walker. He's a local boy that's done good. He has a street, a park, a high school field named after him here. When I was the number one fan when he played football. From the University of Georgia, Herschel Walker. In the self-proclaimed friendliest town in Georgia, it's easy to find support for Walker's Senate campaign. I think he's a man for the job. Nearly 70% of Johnson County voted for Republican Donald Trump in the 2020 presidential election. Herschel's not going to back down. He's a fighter. I've been a lot of places, but in Wrightsville, I learned important lessons. On the trail, Walker is quick to mention his Wrightsville roots. I'm from Wrightsville, Georgia. He has always participated in our famous 4th of July parade that we have every year. He has done camps for youth here, for football. But not everyone in this rural 3,500 person town is cheering him on. He's still Johnson County's favorite son, but most of, people, most of the people in Johnson County don't think he's the right person to be running for Senate. I hope what I wins, really do. Sharika Johnson doesn't feel the multimillionaire former resident has done enough to help Wrightsville, specifically the black community here. We see him what, once a year when he come for the parade? He's yet to campaign in the black community. Curtis Dixon, who was Walker's 10th grade world history teacher and a coach on a state championship high school football team, described him as a good, polite kid who has given back to this community as an adult. Sounds like you liked Herschel as a player and as a student. Still do, but you know, this is business. You don't feel like he's ready. He's not ready. Readiness is a concern even for those who say they'll still probably vote for Walker. I think he ought to just wait it and look inside before running to see what it would take. Herschel Walker paid for an abortion for his then girlfriend. Reports about Walker's turbulent past, including newly surfaced allegations he paid for an ex-girlfriend's abortion more than a decade ago, were not major topics around here. Walker has repeatedly denied the allegations. The residents we spoke with, who said they know Walker, did say they were surprised by his public acknowledgement in June that he had four children. Jerry Owensby is a supporter who's already cast his ballot for Walker, but laments the cost that the campaign has taken on the candidate personally. I wish he hadn't overrun. Explain to me, why not? Because he's too good for politics. It's hurt him with his family. Dixon says he also worries about the impact this race is having on Walker's family, but struggles to reconcile the candidate he sees today with the kid he knew decades ago. The face is there, the hair is there, it's got a little grayer. But uh, I sometimes wonder if that's the same person. Diane Gallagher, CNN, Wrightsville, Georgia.